So yesterday we got a reminder of just how fast thunder and lightning can flare up in our area during the summer, Natalie. That's a new tagline, I think. Absolutely. All right, meteorologist Liam Healy answers one question now we all may keep in mind is what to do when thunder roars. The simple answer, head indoors. That like see a flash and dash inside are two of the most popular sayings you'll hear when talking about lightning safety. And according to Dr. Samantha Scarnero Miller, a sports safety researcher at West Virginia University, whether you hear it or see it, it's dangerous. Huge misconception with light, lightning is that some lightning might not be dangerous. Some things we might call heat lightning or horizontal lightning. All lightning is dangerous. It's also important to note heat lightning is not real. And when you see lightning but don't hear thunder, it's only because you're too far away to hear it, but it's still not far away enough for it to not be dangerous. Important that we evacuate to a safe place. So we should go into a structure that has walls with plumbing and electricity. We should go into our cars or vehicles. Those are considered safe structures. But you see, the thing is, not all cars are created equal. Only cars with a non-removable metal roof like this one offer protection from lightning. Convertibles and cars with a fiberglass roof offer no protection from lightning. You cannot reach a safe location when a thunderstorm is in your area. You should avoid the riskiest places. So don't go to the top of mountains. Don't go in open areas. Don't go to the only tree in the field. Don't go towards water. Dr. Scarneo Miller also recommends having an AED present as often as possible because if someone is struck, that AED can increase their chance of survival. Reporting in Rochester, Liam Healy, News 8.